So I heard about the program through your Facebook page, actually, um, because I've been following it and watching some of the masses that have been live streamed. And then I saw the post and I thought it would be a great opportunity. Uh, I didn't have much to do this summer because of COVID and I just really wanted to try something new and to um, put myself into the community if I could. So uh, I found this through St. Jerome's Facebook page and I thought it would be a lot of fun. And so I found out about the program through my church newsletter which is St. Michael's uh, Waterloo. I hope for some learning experiences I think. Um, about myself and the community elders. My mom, uh, her job is an elderly care worker and from what I've heard from her, um, she has a lot of stories to tell. She really enjoys it and I think she's been changed by um, what she does. So, I hope that we get to learn something new and that we get to share the wonderful stories of the people in our community. Something that feels like it has brought something meaningful to everyone's lives involved. I think it's important, especially in a city like Kitchener or Waterloo, where um, there can be a lot of students who don't necessarily live in the community. Um, you may not know what's going on in the community or the different facets of it, um, and I think that's the best way to learn and experience things is to really put yourself into the community and um, especially with a place like St. Mary's, it's a great downtown community and that means you get people from all over the city. I think that students have a lot to give in their community. A lot of us are in university, we're developing a lot of skills over the past few years and I think it's um, a good opportunity to share our gifts but also to learn something new as well. One thing is the technical side of it really interested me, like working with the video and the audio, that, 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 that really drew me. Um, this is something outside of my comfort zone too, so I think it's important to try new things and just take a leap and do it because you'll probably get something good out of it. I'm starting an accelerated nursing program in the fall, uh, so I'll be working with a lot of elderly individuals and in this program in particular we're going to be focusing on the power of storytelling, so I think it would be a great opportunity to um, practice hearing other people's stories and, and finding uh, interesting ways of delivering them so that their knowledge can be shared and we can learn more about them. I've been speaking to some people um, at my own parish who are elderly and we've been chatting and I've been able to create such um, wonderful relationships with them and learn all these incredible stories like one woman in particular she was in London um, grew up there during the war and she was evacuated as a child and just the different stories that she has in the insight really is inspiring and makes me want to be like a better person 